Hello everybody. Our next camera is the Ansco Craftsman. It was originally available in 1950 as a build-it-yourself kit. Uh, from 51 on, and I'm not sure how long the production run was, it was available as a finished camera. Uh, the kit in 1950 cost $3.50. Even in current money, it's about 10 times that, about $35. So it was an affordable camera. Um, the box body is wood and cardboard with this nice vinyl cover. Uh, the front, the back, and part of the film insert are stamped metal. It uses 120 film. You get eight exposures, two and a quarter by three and a quarter inches, or six by nine centimeters. Um, it has uh, simple mirror finders. It has two of them, like a lot of these box cameras, for portrait orientation or landscape. Um, because it's a simple mirror, uh, the images are left to right reversed. Uh, it has a fixed focus meniscus lens. I did a measurement and it's about 90 millimeters. Somewhere online, and I was unable to find it again, I didn't bookmark it. I read that close focus uh, is 8 feet, so 8 feet to infinity is your range. The shutter sits in front of the lens. That's a single speed rotary shutter. Uh, this one tests out at about a 20th of a second. Probably when it was new, it was more like a 30th of a second. Uh, it's a fixed aperture. I was able to measure it using this trick with some Play-Doh. I had it plastic coated so I didn't get any oil on it. And measured that, divided that into the focal length, and I came up with about F13. Of course, right after I did that, I found another old ad for this that actually says it's F14. Um, it's surprisingly sharp. The large negatives in the inside of this thing is huge. Uh, when the friend who uh, lent it to me first showed it to me, I opened it up and I was like, well, I can't shoot with this. The insert's missing. Well, this is the insert. You just uh, pull out the wind knob and then this whole piece comes out and you've got your take-up spool on the top, your feed spool on the bottom. I was really happy that I was able to borrow this. It's a little tight getting that back in there. I may need to give it back tomorrow, which is why I wanted to hurry up and do this video. I'll see you then.